Why did he do that? Unbelievable. So, Biram, England dropped Chris Folk, Sam Curran and Liam Livingston for David Willey, Gus Atkinson and Ben Stokes, practically cutting down on their batting depth significantly. Why do you think they dropped three main all-rounders? Yeah, why did they do that? Why did England get rid of all of their all-rounders? It's a very, very valid question to ask. So, look, Chris Wokes and Sam Curran were having a stinker. They were not performing well at all. And I understand why England would want to drop them. And, you know, David Willey, they must have thought, could offer something with the bat. So maybe that was the rationale. But what I don't understand is dropping Liam Livingston because he doesn't just offer runs with the bat, right? He's a really good fielder and also provides buffer overs for England. Had been getting an odd breakthrough every now and then, you know, for them. So definitely, I feel like he should have been there. Maybe if they wanted to bring Ben Stokes back, they could have perhaps removed Harry Brook and still have had... Liam Livingston in there. And also, I'm not sure why they aren't playing Moeen Ali. You know, the surface was offering some assistance for the spinners. We saw Adil Rashid turn a few. So maybe Moeen could have been a handful and he adds so much batting depth as well, as well as bowling depth. So I would have definitely had him. And I understand, you know, England had to go with their frontline bowlers who don't bat a lot because their all-rounders weren't firing. But then again, England, the white ball team at least, has been so, so successful. And, you know, the whole formula for that has been... You know, deeper batting lineups and more all-rounders. And they play the way they play because they bat all the way down to 9 or 10. So, really, I'm quite baffled. And Livingston and Moin, I would have definitely had those guys. Absolutely. Moin obviously played the first game. But Liam Livingston, granted he hasn't really fired with the bat. He's done remarkably well with the ball in the middle overs. So, they've actually gone from Liam Livingston at 7 to David Willey at 7. Which is absolutely bizarre. Absolutely. I think bizarre is the correct word to describe this decision. And yes, you viewers also let us know why you think England did this and also whether or not you think it was the right call. We'll be back with another episode soon enough. For now, that's all. Goodbye. Got him! Why did he do that? Unbelievable!